What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. It is the 3rd of July. Tomorrow will be the 4th of July holiday weekend. Today is Monday, though. We're taking a look at Pepe this morning. We will be taking a look first off, though, at the CryptoBubbles.net website, getting a glance at the markets on the daily time frame. What's going on here? We have Flow up 16, Bit up 16, Comp 16, Pepe. 11.4, which is what we're looking at today. FIL 16, GRT 23. Guys, great little website here, cryptobubbles.net. A lot of green in the markets this morning. Wouldn't you know? Guys, daily chart of the good old Pepe, the meme coin. You may hate it. You may love it. But I got to tell you one thing. The trend is higher on this thing right now. So we are not going to ignore that until it turns south. We are going to be paying attention to Pepe here. A couple things going on. It looks like we are getting close. A cup with handle breakout. We'll have to see, though, if it holds or not. So essentially, the cup with handle entry point would be basically right here, the high of the left-hand side of the cup. So you have this cup formation right here. It's a little steep on the right side. And then you have this handle forming. And then the breakout is when it goes past like that. So we will see if that takes place, guys. We are chugging ahead this morning. Looks like according to the BitGet data, uh, Pepe is up 8.69%. And then some other providers there say it's up 11. If you check on Uphold, it is up 11. And then according to Crypto Bubbles, it's up 11. Guys, if you want to buy cryptocurrencies, Pepe XRP, I will leave an Uphold sign-up link down in the video description. All links, as always, are down in the video description description. So what is going on here? We have a couple of levels. So we have some potential resistance above the market at the 187, 177. That's this white line on the chart. Although it is above the market, we're currently trading at 172, 302. Again, that level is 187, 177 right here. And then we have a couple more upper targets 213,900, 248,571, and two. So some nice markers ahead here for the price. A couple more up here as well. 478, 877, 627, 765, guys. Way, way up here. If we throw the Fibonacci's, on here, guys. We'll take that swing high. We'll take the low here of the the cup part of the cup with handle. To get us to our first Fibonacci level, we'll be up here at the 1618 Fib level. That is right here, guys. So that would take the price. Now, there's no guarantee, of course, that this will happen. That will take the price up roughly about 630 or so percent. Getting back up to all-time highs will be about 150, 160 percent move. So, and that could happen. If this cup with handle breaks out and it looks like it might be breaking out today, we'll have to see, then you could easily be back up to all-time highs. Another FIB level here based on from where we're currently at would be the 2618, and that would take the price up about 3,700%. So we'll have to see. We have a lot of roadblocks ahead of before something like that would take place. One being our three levels, 187, 213, 240. And then we have the all-time high, and then we have 478 and 627. So again, 
all-time highs takes the price roughly about up 160 or so percent then our first fib retracement would take the price up roughly about 620 630 percent so that is some exciting things here so far like i said this thing is bullish and the trend is higher we are stair stepping to the upside our pullback is holding quite well we had a nice red candle on the 28th of june and so far the buyers have been back in so i am watching these levels 187 213 240 and if we get above that you know what it is it's the all-time high here looks like the all-time price all-time high price according to this bit get would be 44 nine thousand 44 nine thousand there's still five zeros if i'm correct above in front of the price five zeros 173 200 is where we are currently trading at pepe is up from its pullback lows here its major pullback lows give or take about 109 percent anybody buying there so far is sitting up quite nice and like i said the trend we are let me say this real quick this this is interesting so we had this pretty steady decline here right we start to get this rounding bottom we trade up here to a lower high we pull back right here on the 20th of june we printed a higher low and if you watch my previous videos i talked about when markets are in a, a downtrend and they pull back they print a lower high and then they go on to print a higher low that higher low is an early warning shot that there's a potential big rally coming for the market and the trend may be changing back to the upside and i've said in previous videos when you see that higher low the rally to follow can be very strong and we saw a very strong rally to follow from there roughly a you can call it a 90 to 100 percent rally in one two three and four days so that is a i just noticed that that is a great example but like I said, the trend has changed back to the upside. And so far, it's holding quite well. And, you know, that could change quickly back to the downside, depending on what the rest of the markets do. Quick look at my screen. Looks like Bitcoin is up just a little bit, not too much. Now, it's not eight, per, not nine point, um, not 10% like Pepe, but it is holding up well. Anyways, we're getting this nice coupled handle here. It looks like we're approaching a breakout. Breakout point would be roughly, well, I guess essentially it would be the the 178, 320 level. And looking for that to blast above in a big, big way. So the Pepe Bulls are in control. Are there much higher prices to come? Will Pepe? rally another roughly 160 or so percent from where it's at now back to all-time highs this is a very nice looking basing structure here and it looks like the bulls may have this thing in control for the days and weeks ahead all-time highs that would be cool I don't know one day at a time but right now it is looking quite bullish so let me know your thoughts down in the comments on pepe guys welcome to the channel if you are not yet subscribed go ahead and join us appreciate it and we'll have to see here i have some much higher targets for pepe i will show you those real quick once again before we wrap this video up my highest target is up there at the 627 765 level so that gets the price back above all-time highs and like i said that is roughly going to be a about a 260 or so percent move 
higher, but it will lead to all-time highs if those targets are hit. Cup with handle. What a great pattern. One of the first patterns I learned in the markets was a cup with handle pattern. A teacup with handle. And then boom, and then you get that breakout. Wouldn't it be cool if it played out just like that? Picture, perfect. You guys have a great 3rd of July. Tomorrow is the 4th. I will be back with some more videos. Take care.